to Utah to visit some of our friends and family for a few weeks. So we thought it would be cool to show you guys what we use on the plane as some of our plane essentials to make long plane rides less boring mm -hmm. because sometimes you're on the plane and you are bored out of your mind. Or you're cold. Yes, or you need something that you don't have. So we're going to show you guys what we use or what we keep on the planes to make it bearable. Mm -hmm. First things first, um, we needed a bag to pack all our stuff in, so we found this one. It's just a simple handbag, and we're going to be able to put all of our stuff in it and carry it on the plane. So this is the bag we're using. The next thing I pack is usually a little wallet. Normally you can keep like a bigger one that holds like your money or your ID or your, you know, your driver's license if you're that old. Um, but while you're traveling, um, I like to downgrade kind of to a smaller one so I can just keep some cash and whatever I need in here. And this one's kind of actually old. I probably need a new one. It's kind of falling apart. Mm -hmm. But I, this is what I keep all my money and stuff yeah. in. Next, um, of course, I always need my phone with me at all times. I'm a teenager. Plus, you got to be able to com communicate people even though you're on a plane. You want to keep this with you. Um, next up, I usually keep like Tic Tacs, something to suck on. You know, when you're on a plane, I usually tend to get hungry even if they do give me snacks. Yes. So I do keep these little things to suck on to, you know, kind of keep the hunger down. And we also have other snacks that we like to bring mm -hmm. as well. Yeah, I'll grab them. So, yeah, we have these snacks. And they're just little like portable yummies that are just like, sna you can snack on. And these are dried apples. They're like crunchy mm -hmm. and yummy. These and, are my favorite. Yeah. So I love to pack them when I want to plane. And also yeah. Teddy Grahams, because we like to snack on Teddy Grahams. And, and they're, they're yummy. fun and yummy, yes. Next we have a jacket. Doesn't really matter what jacket, because it always gets cold. I always get cold on planes. Planes tend to be freezing, and I don't know so why. I so I like to pack a jacket in case yes. it gets cold on the plane. Yes, I do too. Um, next up, I usually pack a charger. Some planes have plug-ins that you can like plug your chargers into and, and plug not, your phones in. You bring if the Mophie. Not, yeah, you can bring a Mophie. This is we actually bring a Mophie. I like to bring. A this is actually called a <laughs> Halo, but it's it's not a Mophie. But a Mophie is a type of portable charger. Yeah, because so you, you never that. know when you're going to charge your phone. Yeah. So having a Mophie with me at all times is very important. And don't forget your your charger either, because you're going to need yeah. the cord. Next I have, I usually like to pack like a little bag with all my little necessities, like my personal hygiene stuff, earplugs, uh, tissues, tissues, you know, chapstick, hand sanitizer, hand sanitizer, lotion, kind of all the little liquids in one bag so that when you, um, they scan it because you know when you go through airport security mm -hmm. they have to scan all the liquids. They're all yeah. in like one place and they can just scan. I also like to pack like um, ibuprofen or something in case you get a headache. And also melatonin, which is an herb that helps you sleep. So in case you have like a really long flight, I like to pack, you know, stuff that helps. And if you're not a sleeper like I am, you can always, I always bring my phone, or not my phone, my phones and my books that will help distract me. So I just keep a book with me so I can read, you know, if it's a long flight, I can read. Mm -hmm. Or you can bring homework if it's during the school year. I like to do that too because it gives me time to finish my homework and I'm still probably going on vacation. And uh, one of my last, I don't know if you have any more, I have a, this is my last thing, is socks. I, my feet for some reason are always cold, so when I get on a plane, I already mentioned the planes are cold, so I bring a jacket and I bring socks in case my toes are cold. <laughs> you can put the socks Very on. Very important. My toes need to be comfortable. And for your sleeping, you usually bring a neck pillow. I know I do because the seat, the, you know, the heads, the little plain seat things. They're always so uncomfortable on your neck, so the neck pillows are really comfy to sleep on, and they're portable, so we bring these as well. Mm -hmm. I mentioned these earlier, and they're actually dried peaches, not dried apples, but they're still delicious, and I still love to pack them. Mm -hmm. And you can get them at Target if you want to, you, you know, pack them for your plain essentials bag if you're making one, so. And last but not least, gum. This is very important because if you're like me, you do not like takeoff and freak out like a chicken, but it's okay. Um, gum is there, oh, also for landing, landing that's yeah. true, for takeoff and landing, but I like, I like If landing. you chew the gum, you know, the motion, something about it keeps your ears, like, ears un from plugging, unplugging, you know, because you know, if you do take off or land, it, your ears usually plug. Or you just want your breath to smell good. Either yeah. way, gum is a necessity for the plane. Is that all we have? I think so. Sweet. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Mm -hmm. um, I hope you enjoyed seeing what we usually pack in our airplane essentials bags. Um, Don't forget to leave a comment below on places you have traveled or are going to travel to during this summer. And also, don't forget to follow us on Instagram at Brooklyn and Bailey, and we will see you guys next week. Bye! Bye! Oh yeah, and then I'm going to do the same thing. I have mini M&Ms, and I'm going to sprinkle it on top of the top of the banana. Just so you can get it covered and delicious. You can put any of that you want on there. Hi guys, 
it's been a bit, sorry, <laughs> I'm used to saying Brooklyn myth.